everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you my favorite moisturizers to use after tanning, whether it be outside tanning or indoor tanning. I have a couple different moisturizers, both higher end and some drugstore ones to show you guys and tell you about. And then also stay tuned to the end of this video because I am doing another giveaway. I recently hit 300 subscribers and I want to give back to you guys again. So stay tuned to the end to figure out how you can enter the giveaway and let's go ahead and get started with the moisturizer. So it's really, really important to moisturize your skin after you've been out laying in the sun or in a tanning bed because obviously the heat from the sun and the rays can really dry out your skin. So I have a couple moisturizers here that I'm gonna show you guys. So I personally have tried many, many, many moisturizers because I have very, very sensitive skin and super dry skin all the time. So I'm always on the lookout for like a good lotion that will actually moisturize my skin and keep it moisturized for longer than like an hour and that won't make me break out or itch or just have like an allergic reaction to the lotion. So I have found five lotions I'm gonna share with you guys today that I personally love and I use them all the time after I am done tanning or just on a regular basis in general. Okay, so this first lotion is just kind of a classic for me. It's a lotion that has been my daily moisturizer for years and I just love it. So this is honestly just the Walmart brand Equate, their store brand, um, After Sun Cool Lime Lotion with pure aloe in it. So like I said, I did use this as a daily moisturizer for a very long time, but I started off using it as just a lotion that I would put on after I was out in the sun for a while. I burn super, super easily out in the sun. So in the summer, aloe quickly becomes my best friend. So it has the aloe in it, which is just like instant relief from the sunburn when I put this on and then it's also kind of cooling feeling on my skin so once I put it on even without storing it like in a cool place it just feels cold on the burn just makes your skin feel a little less hot and a little bit more soothed after being burnt so bad out there the one thing I will say about this is that you do have to apply it a little bit more often at least for myself I have found I do um, because it's a little less I don't know if you can tell but it's not very thick in here it's a little bit more watery so it, it soaks into your skin pretty quickly and then you will have to apply a little bit more especially if you're out in the sun and that's the only downfall to this but it is literally like four dollars I think at Walmart. It's super cheap and it works really well for its price. And it smells really good. It smells just like lime, which is a nice refreshing scent. Okay, so the next lotion I have to show you guys is this one. This is by Ocean Potion and it is the Moisturizing After Sun Lotion, also with aloe. This one is more of a recent discovery. It's another lotion that I have no problem using as a daily moisturizer. It's nice because it's a little bit thicker. It's not as watery as the other one is. So I do find that it lasts a little bit longer on my skin. And this one smells amazing. It smells just like key lime, which is one of my favorite scents. It smells so good. And then what I do like about this one is that it actually, I've noticed, helps extend your tan a little bit more. The cool lime one, I would say, is more of like a relief. So if you get burned or if you're just hot kind of thing, I'd put this one on. But if you're trying to keep a tan or keep the color that you have going, I would do something more like this because it does help extend it a little bit. This one does have vitamin D3 in it, which helps keep your skin a little bit stronger and healthier. So with your skin being a little bit stronger, it does help keep your tan a little bit longer. I believe this one was about $6 at Walmart, so also pretty inexpensive for a moisturizer. It's a huge bottle, so you get a lot and these things do last a long time, but this is another one of my drugstore favorites. Those of you who watch my videos know that I absolutely adore Devoted Creations and it doesn't just stop with tanning lotions. Their moisturizers are amazing too. So this first one I have to show you is the Love and Lemonade Moisturizer by Devoted Creations. It's an after sun daily moisturizer with ultra hydrating aloe, cucumber, and vitamin C. So the very first thing that I noticed about this when I first tried it is the scent. It smells just like very strong lemonade. It is a super strong scent, but it smells so good and just screams summer to me. What I love about this and the other Devoted Creations lotions is that they are aloe-based. The two that I showed you from the drugstore are actually both water-based, even though they have aloe in them, but these are aloe-based, so they're a lot more soothing, a lot more calming, and just provide better relief for your skin in general. This one's a little bit different and kind of cool because I find it to be more of like a gel consistency. It almost feels like the consistency of like aloe, like the gel aloe, so it almost provides like that cooling relief that aloe does provide also, but then it's nice because it's not super thick so it doesn't feel heavy on your skin or anything and although it absorbs really quickly and it doesn't just sit on your skin you don't feel sticky it lasts a long time I've noticed that this will last me about like eight hours or so which is really really good for my skin because like I said I have super dry skin and I have to put lotion on like that normally something with a scent as strong as this one would really irritate my skin and make me itchy but this is a hypoallergenic lotion so that's even better it's really great for people with sensitive skin okay so the next two lotions are my absolute favorite tanning moisturizers ever and they are also by devoted creations they are from the Sony Naughty Nude line. This one is just the So Naughty Nude and this one is the Oh So Sexy and I love these lotions. This was the first one that I tried out and I love it because it is a thick cream. 
I mainly use this one in the winter time. This lasted me about all winter and it was great because in the winter my skin gets even drier than it normally is which is just awesome and so obviously that means I'm gonna need a lot thicker and like more heavy-duty lotion. So this was a little bit thicker of a cream but it lasted so long. I could maybe apply this once a day and I was perfectly fine until the next morning. I find that this one is even thicker than this one but I really liked about this one is that it's actually just a white lotion so there is no color to it or anything but it does extend your tan still. So before using this I would go tanning maybe on like a Monday or so and then skip a couple days and then I would definitely notice a decrease in color. My tan was definitely just fading away super super quickly but then when I started using this I would tan one day and then skip a couple days but my tan really wouldn't budge. It would still be around the same color because this does help extend the tan really really well. These are both aloe based as well so they are extra hydrating for your skin. Then this one is cool because it does actually have the bronze color so if you're into if you want a bronze lotion this would be a really good one. It is kind of dark. Not only does it help extend your tan it adds to your tan. And then I really really love this one scent. This one has more of like a fresh scent which I do really like but I smelled this one and it is amazing. It's like a sweeter scent. You know why I probably like it? kind of smells like key lime. This one also has caffeine in it which does noticeably help tighten your skin. Tanning really can promote wrinkles and everything so anything that you can do to help tighten up your skin to kind of help prevent that and I do notice that when I do put this on my legs they just my skin just feels tighter and a little bit more firm so I really do think that that does help. Both of these lotions are amazing and I absolutely love this brand. I'm going to go ahead and leave links down below to all of these lotions so you guys can check them out online if you want to. Unfortunately Devoted Creations does not sell their lotions on their website but I will also leave a link so that you can check out all of their distributors and find one near you. Okay, so now moving on to the giveaway part of this video. I am doing a giveaway because I reached 300 subscribers and that's just amazing. And the last giveaway I did got really good feedback and I loved doing that with you guys, so we're gonna do it again. So the prizes for this giveaway are going to be these two items. I have the Love and Lemonade Lotion and then this is the Glam Glow Facial Tanning Bronzer and I actually just talked about this in my last video, so I will go ahead and leave a link up here for that. And also two samples of the Folia Healthy Beauty Anti-Aging Skin Treatment from Beauty Theory Skin Care. And I am going to be talking about this in a video coming up very, very soon. Keep an eye out for that, but I'm going to include the sample so that you guys can try it as well and see how you like it. So that is the first prize, the lotion and the little samples. And then the second prize is going to be the Glammed Glowed. Also in that prize, I'm including another one of the samples for the Folia skincare. If you want to receive either one of these prizes, all you have to do is, number one, subscribe to this channel. Number two, follow me on Instagram, which I will leave here on the screen and it's also always down in the description box if you're interested. And then number three, go down in the comments and comment enter me and then tell me what your favorite tanning lotion is or lotion brand that works too but just make sure to say enter me at the top tell me your favorite lotion and also comment your Instagram name so that I can find you if you are the winner and contact you this giveaway is actually going to run for two weeks this time so on June 5th at 1159 this giveaway will close and then I will pick the winner and announce it in a video after that so yeah that's all you have to do to enter is just subscribe Instagram and then comment down below and then you have until June 5th to enter so as always thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for all the support and the 300 subscribers. I get so excited about that kind of stuff and I cannot wait to get back to you guys. So thank you once again. Go ahead and start entering and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!